What's up? What's up? No, you trying to. See, I'm not really a fan of energy drinks, but I'm trying to drink less coffee for one primary reason. Coffee stains your teeth and these things don't. <sighs> Downtown LA. A lot of people have been commenting what happened to riding around with the GoPro, dipping in traffic, doing all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna try and do exactly that. I'm gonna try and do exactly that before the sun sets, cause it's already setting. Time change, man. What up? <laughs> Freezing and I have a limited amount of time to film before the sun sets. Oh, the arm's stuck. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it. Awesome, awesome. Just set all my stuff up and then I saw this sign that says I'm gonna get towed in 20 minutes if I stay here. So I gotta move. That would be my BMW if I stayed in that spot. Woo! Parking attempt number two. I should be good here. This is where I usually park. Setting the bike up, action cam time. Wasting no time. Set a setting. Let's see what I can do. <laughs> What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Let's go. Homie's got a clip. Oh. Give him one more shot. He's cool. Oh. Two security guys now. We gotta go. We're leaving. Sorry. Wait, at least we got what? Two extra tries? Only thing left for me to do is T-bog it. Should I get the T-bog? Yeah, I'll get you, bro. Let me see how it feels. <laughs> yeah, it should be easy, T-bog. Oh! Oh, oh. I was going way too slow. <laughs> Alright, bro. Oh. Let me give it one more shot. One more shot. Just one more, please. Just one more. And then we out of here. Thanks, bro. Not the craziest T bog before. Got the T bog. I've been wanting to do this T bog for a minute. Shout out to the homie for filming. Yeah, Shout out to the homie for checking traffic. All right, pedaling onward, continuing the journey. Where should we go next? Let's go. This way. Yo, what year is this Porsche? 57? It's beautiful, man. Thank you, man. Yeah. Crazy. 
crazy. Uh. Yo! Oh, heads up. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up? No, you trying to start shit. What's the deal? Wow, bro. Crazy. Yeah, we're getting kicked out here ASAP. Oh, oh my God. Sir, hey, you got the moves. Skirting. <laughs> okay, let's head back to OSS. Let's go. It's getting dark. Yeah, no problem. It is getting dark, so I need I need to get back to my big camera because uh, this GoPro is really bad in low light. So I'm gonna head back to the OSS store. These boys are gonna chill there, and then I'm gonna get my big camera and continue tonight's mission. Who knows what will happen? I think it's already it's already peaked with that psycho guy in the car. That. <laughs> The psycho guy in the Audi, can you believe that shit? Yo, it would have been the craziest scene. As there would have been like hundreds of people filming at that point. It was in the middle of traffic. Crazy guy in the Audi taking off on some kids. Oh! Yo, it last day. That shit was fun. Hold up, hold up. Now, pretty much anyone who knows me can attest to the fact that I'm very non-confrontational. I'm very peaceful. I'm nice. <laughs> like, I, I don't seek problems with anybody. If you're in traffic and you're like threatening kids on their bikes, I don't know. That just, it struck a nerve with me. And I couldn't just let it go unchecked, basically, is what I'm saying. Now, in that situation, the guy could have pulled over. I could have chatted to him about how he should have been more patient. He could have said, hey, you should have been not as much in the street, whatever. Could have been fine. Instead, he chose to let his temper get the best of him and try and confront us. So, I mean, at the end of the day, nothing happened. Nobody fought. It escalated to nothing. The guy got back in his car and left. On with the day. I'm starving. I haven't eaten anything today. So, I'm going to try and find some food. I might just head home. Today was crazy. That guy was crazy. Didn't expect for anything like that to happen, but it did. I'm not sorry for the way I acted either. That was, I think, totally justified by how psychotic that dude was acting. Like, you don't get out of your car in traffic and threaten kids at all. That's never okay. Dude, this thing is amazing. It's beautiful. Thank you. How long have you been building it? Okay. Sick. Thanks, dude. Have not been here in way too long. All right, today's Q&A question is from Acid Burns. He says, do you ever get home after shooting an entire day's worth of footage and look at the vlog and be like, what am I doing? Kind of ambiguous question. I'm not really sure what you mean by that, but if you mean like, do I have a video? Yes, I often get home and I start editing and I'm like, there's kind of no direction to this video, but that's kind of how most days are. I'd say one or two days every week. I actually have a plan for what I'm gonna do. The rest I just kind of like get out. Like today, I'm just gonna get out and see what happens. But yes, in a, in a roundabout type of way, yeah, I kind of do get home and wonder what I'm doing because I 
I kind of have to make a story backwards. Like I take all the footage and then I like cut it down and then I'm like, huh, how can I make the most sense out of this? And usually that's how it goes. Sometimes it's very linear, sometimes it's not. But I, I hope that answered your question. I feel like I might have, maybe I didn't, I don't know. Either way, leave your question below for tomorrow's Q&A and I will answer it. And that's gonna do it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Hashtag HicksFam, hit the like button. I love all you guys and I will see you tomorrow. That's a wrap. Peace. Oh. <laughs> oh shit. Not the craziest T-Bar.